皆さんこんにちは。タカジャパニーズ・ランゲージカルチャーのタカです。Hello everyone, this is Taka from Taka Japanese Language and Culture.From this video, I'll introduce Kyoto for three times.This is the first one.After you watch this video, you can know how to make trip much fun. The reason why I introduced Kyoto today is the voting on my Twitter. Thank you for voting, everyone, and I'm sorry for waiting you to show it. So, let's get started! Today's table of contents. At first, I'll tell you about this channel. Next, highlights of Kyoto, then quiz time, and last, today's kanji. So, check it out. At first, I'll tell you about me and this channel. I'm a university student who loves trip and Japanese culture. This channel is for Japanese lovers. I show you Japanese places or culture and language in English. After you watch videos, you can understand something new about Japan. My English is not so good, but I'll do my best. Please enjoy watching! At first, do you know where is Kyoto? Kyoto is the west side of Honshu. It takes two hours to there from Tokyo by bullet train, Shinkansen line. It is known for its historic cityscape. In my opinion, Kyoto's interesting points are beautiful buildings, great history, and delicious food. And today, I introduce beautiful buildings and great history. If you go to Kyoto, please remember it. It makes us easy to trip by sectionalized like a city. Sectionalized like this. Okay, like this. And today, I'll introduce two sections of six. At first, near the Kyoto station. Highlights. Near the Kyoto station. There are four highlights near the Kyoto station. At first, Fushimi Inari Taisha. Fushimi Inari Taisha. Fushimi Inari Taisha. Next is Kyoto Tower. Kyoto Tower. Kyoto Tower. Next one is 西本願寺西本願寺西本願寺 and 東寺京王五国寺東寺京王五国寺 sometimes we say 東寺 and sometimes we say 京王五国寺 you should use 東寺 at first 伏見稲荷大社 It was selected as number one for five years in the ranking of the popular sightseeing spots among foreign tourists in Japan. If you make wish when you pass the gate, you will get a good luck. This is the video which I took. And foxes. This is a fox. Foxes are messengers of Inari God. And this is called Omokaru Ishi. Omokaru Ishi. Omokaru Ishi. It literally means something like heavy or light stone. This is the heavy or light stone. Omokaru Ishi. At first, you are supposed to make a wish in mind in front of the lantern. Then, hold up the stone on the lantern. If the stone is lighter than you expected, your wish will come true soon. But if you feel it's heavy, unfortunately, your wish will take time to come true, or it won't come true. This is Omokaru Ishi. If you get there, please try it. So, 
That's all of Fushimi Nari Taisha. Then I'll introduce Kyoto Tower. Kyoto Tower. Kyoto Tower. It is 131 meters high tower. There is an observatory where 100 meters above the ground. The scenery is like this. You can see Kyoto's cityscape from here. At night, tower is illuminated. Its scenery is beautiful too. Please visit there daytime and nighttime. That's all of Kyoto Tower. Then, next one is Nishi Honganji. Nishi Honganji. Nishi Honganji. Sometimes it is called Onishi san. Onishi san. Onishi san. By Kyoto people with regards. Onishi san. It is a temple of Jodo Shinshu. Which, uh, which is sometimes called Shin Buddhism. There is a Shinran's grave who was founder of Jodo Shinshu. There are many national treasures of important cultural property. Especially, I like these two kinds of buildings Hyunkaku and Karamon. Hyunkaku is named after it seems like a cloud floating in the sky. Here is the pond, and it seems like a cloud floating in the sky. This is Hyunkaku. 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 And this is Karamon. Karamon. Karamon's highlight is curved animals. There are many curved animals in there. So when you get there and see it, And please search it. Please search what kind of animals in there. Please check it. You can、uh, you can find it easily. Please check it. This is Karamon. That's all of Nishi Honganji. Then, last one of near the Kyoto Station is last one is Toji Kyo o Gokokuji. Sometimes we say Toji. So, In this video, I use Toji. I call it Toji. It is the only remains of Heian Kyo. The year 794. This is the only remains of Heian Kyo. This is the temple of esoteric Buddhism. It was founded in 796 under Emperor Kanmu's order. And it is associated with Kukai. He is Kukai. Kukai is renowned Buddhist priest in the Heian period. Toji's highlight is arrangement of temple buildings. This is the Toji's arrangement of temple buildings. According to one theory, Kukai tried to express m e s s a g e that coexistence. For example, in the center of temple, One building's origin s in Chinese culture and another one's origin is Indian culture. This is coexistence. So, sometimes one theory, Kukai try to express message that coexistence to the temple's arrangement. That's all of Toji. So, next one is. North east side of Kyoto Station. Near the Kyoto Station, but north, side, north east side of Kyoto Station. In highlights, in north east side of Kyoto Station is Kiyomizu Dera. Kiyomizu Dera. Kiyomizu Dera. And Yasaka Jinja. Yasaka Jinja. Yasaka Jinja. And Yasaka Koshindo. Yasaka Koshindo. Yasaka Koshindo. At first, I'll tell you about Kiyomizu Dera. It is designated as a UNESCO World Heritage Site, categorized as a historic monument of ancient Kyoto. 
This is Kiyomi's villa. So beautiful in autumn. And it is also known for an end of year event in which the chief priest writes one Chinese character to symbolize the year. This is at Kiyomi's villa. And it is well known, Kiyomi's villa is well known for its stage. Stage is here. And stage is here. It is almost as tall as four stories building. It is almost as far as tall as four stories buildings. So high. And another famous place is this place. Its name is Otowa no Taki. Otowa no Taki. Otowa no Taki is、uh, maybe here. This is Otowa no Taki. It is spring water that has been floating for more than 1000 years. It is floating for more than 1000 years. And among the three lines of spring water, three lines of the spring water, the left one gives you a good luck on studying. Good luck on studying. And middle one, middle one on love and relationships. And right one is for long life. So,、uh, make a wish and drink the water. Your dreams come true. Your wish come true. So, please try it when you visit Kiyomi's Dera. That's all for Kiyomi's Dera. Then, Next one is Yasaka Jinja. Yasaka Jinja. Yasaka Jinja. Yasaka Jinja. Jinja means shrine, respects Susano no Mikoto, and Kushinada Hime no Mikoto, and Yahashira no Mikogami. This is a Japanese. Japanese. Mysterious. Japanese myth. Susano no Mikoto is a great, go, go, great god in Japanese mythology, known for his defeat, Yamata no Orochi, which is a symbol of many disasters. In July, Giyon Matsuri is held. Giyon Matsuri is three Japanese big,、uh, big carnival, big festival. So famous festival in Japan. In July, Giyon Matsuri is held. It is one of the Japan's three greatest festivals. It has held for over 1,100 years. Please come and watch it. So, if you want to see it, please go to Yasaka Jinja in July. That's all for Yasaka Jinja. The last one is Yasaka Koushindo. Yasaka Koushindo. Yasaka Koushindo. Almost halfway point between Kiyomizdera and Yasaka Jinja, there is a Yasaka Koushindo. Its unique culture is Kukurizaru, which literally means bound monkey. Kukurizaru, bound monkey. This contains a wish for people must not be good greedy for gain. In addition, Yasaka Koshindo is very photogenic. Look at this, so cute! It's really popular among Japanese teenagers. Please take photos with wearing kimono. That's all, that's all for Yasaka Koshindo. And how was it? If you get interest in Kyoto, I'm very happy. Then, quiz time! What kind of animal? In the Messenger of Inari God, Inari God is Fushimi Inari Taisha's God. Do you remember it? I said it. But if you cannot remember it, please back the video and watch it. Okay, the answer is Fox. Fox is Messenger of Inari God. Can you memorize it? 
Okay, that's good. So today's kanji, today's kanji is this Chinese character. Sound is kyo oa kei. Kyo oa kei. Meaning is imperial capital. This Chinese character used for Kyoto's kyo. Please remember it and memorize it. Can it make sense? Okay, that's good. Thank you for watching. That's all for today. Please wait and watch next video of Kyoto. While you are waiting, watch another video. Then, see you in the next. Bye bye. Mata ne.